In the grave they laid him, love from hatred slain, thinking that he would never wake again. Laid in the earth like grain that sleeps unseen, love is come again like wheat arising green. For he came at Easter like the risen grain, he that for three days in the grave had lain, raised from the dead by living Lord is seen, love is come again like wheat arising grain. Good day and welcome to the Holy Mass from St. Andrew's Church in Taunton. A special welcome to all who are watching in the local TV, TCAM, on the websites, the internet, whatever way you are watching it, you're very welcome. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with all of you. And with your spirit. We just pause now for a moment, asking the Lord again to remove all the distractions, the worries, the fears and doubts from our minds. I confess to To Almighty God God, and to you, my my brothers brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore I ask, Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Let us pray. O God, hope and light of the sincere, we humbly entreat you to dispose of They had them flogged, ordered them to stop speaking in the name of Jesus, and dismissed them. So they left the presence of the Sanhedrin, rejoicing that they had been found worthy to suffer dishonor for the sake of the name. And all day long, both at the temple and in their homes, they did not stop teaching and proclaiming the Christ Jesus, the word of the Lord. One thing I seek is to dwell within God's house. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom should I fear? The Lord is my life's refuge. Of whom should I be afraid? One thing I seek is to dwell within God's house. Alleluia. on every word that comes forth from the mouth of God. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. Jesus went across the Sea of Galilee. A large crowd followed him because they saw the signs he was performing on the sick. Jesus went up the mountain, and there he sat down with his disciples. The Jewish feast of Passover was near. 
When Jesus raised his eyes and saw the large crowd was coming to him, he said to Philip, Where can we buy food for them to eat? He said this to test him, because he himself knew what he was going to do. Philip answered him, Two hundred days' wages worth of food would not be enough for each of them to have a little. One of his disciples, Andrew, the brother of Simon Peter, said to him, There is a boy here who has five barley loaves and two fish, but what good are these for so many? Jesus said, Have the people recline. Now there was a great deal of grass in that place. So the men reclined, about five thousand in number. Then Jesus took the loaves, gave thanks, distributed them to those who were reclining, and also as much of the fish as they wanted. When they had their fill, he said to his disciples, Gather up the fragments left over, so that nothing will be wasted. So they collected them and filled twelve wicker baskets with fragments from the five barley loaves that had been more than they could eat. When the people saw the sign he had done, they said, This is truly the prophet, the one who is to come into the world. Since Jesus knew that they were going to come and carry him off to make him a king, he withdrew again to the mountain alone. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise, Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Good day again. As I read this Gospel from John today, here Jesus is in a deserted place. The people follow him. It's a large number. We're told it's around 5,000. And Jesus is feeling pity for them because he didn't want to dismiss them in that area because there was no shops around to buy food. So he asked the disciples, how much food do you have to give them? And their response was, look, what we have is, is basically nothing. There is a boy here who has two fish and five loaves. What good is that for so many? And he told the people to recline on the grass, to sit down. And we're told that he blessed the bread, the fish, and distributed to the 5,000. We are told they all ate and were satisfied. This is a prelude to what would happen later when Jesus would literally give his own body as food on the Calvary, on the cross. Every Mass, we receive the Eucharist after the consecration. But these days, I find it difficult to speak about the Eucharist to you at home knowing that you cannot come and receive the Eucharist right now to your churches. And I just this morning want to read what the Pope said on April the 17th in his private chapel as he was speaking about this very thing. He was speaking about live streaming as we're doing right now to the people. And this is what the Pope said the Pope warns of the danger in online masses. Pope Francis said that forced isolation devised to stop the pandemic was presenting the danger of people living the faith only for themselves, detached from the sacraments, the church and the people of God. Online masses and spiritual communion do not represent the church. He said in his homily at his morning mass in the chapel of his residence on April the 17th. This is the church in a difficult situation. 
that the Lord is allowing, but the ideal of the church is always with the people and with the sacraments. One's relationship with Jesus is intimate. It is personal, but it is in a community. And the closeness to Christ without community, without the Eucharist, without the people of God assembled together, and without the sacraments is dangerous, he said. He goes on to say, it is dangerous, he said, because people could start living their relationship with God for just myself, detached from the people of God. By broadcasting his morning mass, for example, people are in communion, but they are not together, he said. The very small number of people present at his daily morning mass will receive the Eucharist, he said, but not the people watching online who will only have spiritual communion. This is not the church, Pope Francis said, reminding us that there is a great danger in online streaming. Because people might say, well, I'm comfortable at home and I can watch it here. That's true, but you can't receive the Eucharist. You're isolated from the community. And we have to somehow, over the next few weeks or months, think of some way how we can protect people. That's the first thing to do, protect people, but at the same time, give them the sacraments, the Eucharist. When you go to your supermarket at the moment, I believe they leave in maybe 10 at a time. Then they come out, the others go in. That's food for the body. But we also need food for the soul. And we have to do something, devise a way that we can protect people from the virus, but at the same time, give them Holy Communion. The words of scripture again that are very clear. I am the vine, you are the branches. In other words, the vine, the Eucharist, we receive as we're connected. And we know that when we're not connected to the vine, to the Eucharist, it is very difficult for us to be spiritually fed. So we pray that our governments, our leaders in the church will devise a way that people will again receive the Eucharist, the sacraments, and we pray for that, especially these days. Amen? Let us humbly now again today bring our prayers before Almighty God, asking him to hear them and answer them according to our needs. For church leaders, may God embolden them as a shepherd of the faithful, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For world leaders, may God's spirit of peace move them in carrying out their responsibilities. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the sick, may Christ, the divine physician, bring them healing and consolation. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For those gathered here and for our family and friends, may God open our hearts to the grace offered through the Holy Eucharist, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For our beloved dead, may they experience the fullness of God's love and mercy in his kingdom. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Mass intentions are for Ruth Medeiros, which is her 20th anniversary, Doris McGlynn, Sheila Julio, and Rena Sullivan. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. And we continue now to pray for all those who are listening and watching at home, that very shortly you will be able to receive the Eucharist once again. Let us pray to the Lord. We continue praying now for all in the area who are sick, in a special way the dying, and we pray for all those who look after the sick and the dying. Let us pray to the Lord. 
And we pause now for a moment in the silence of your own hearts. Heavenly Father, you know the needs in the hearts of each one listening and watching to this Holy Mass. We bring all our prayers before you through the intercession of the Blessed Mother, Saint Joseph, all the angels free from sin and the saints, as we say the Hail Mary together. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. When we eat this bread and we drink this cup, we proclaim your death until you come. Where two or three are gathered together in my name, where two or three are gathered together, there am I. We proclaim your death until you come. Pray, brethren, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice of your hands. Praise and praise and praise Accept in compassion, Lord, we pray, the offerings of your family that under your protective care they may never lose what they have received, but attain the gifts that are eternal through Christ our Lord. The Lord be with you. Lift up your hearts. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation at all times to acclaim you, O Lord, but in this time, above all, to laud you yet more gloriously, when Christ our Passover has been sacrificed, through him the children of light rise to eternal life, and the halls of the heavenly kingdom are thrown open to the faithful. For his death is our ransom from death, and in his rising the life of all has risen. Therefore overcome with paschal joy, Every land, every people exalts in your praise, and even the heavenly powers with the angelic hosts sing together the unending hymn of your glory as they acclaim. Holy, 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 Lord God of Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. We now again come to the most sacred part of the Mass, the Eucharistic prayer. You are indeed holy, O Lord the fountain of all holiness. Make holy therefore these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you.
in a similar way. When supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples saying, take this all of you and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life, and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you've held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, Edgar, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember, also our brothers and sisters who've fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy welcome them into the light of your face have mercy on us all we pray that with the blessed virgin mary mother of god with blessed joseph her spouse with the blessed apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. Amen. At the Saviour's command, and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Saviour, Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your Church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. May the peace of the Lord be with you always. Amen. Let us offer each other some. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Miserere nobis, miserere Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Miserere nobis, miserere nobis. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Dona nobis pace. Dona nobis pace. 
This is Jesus, the risen Lord, the healer. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter into my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed. May the body of Christ keep me safe for eternal life. Keep me safe for eternal life. Amen. At this time, you can make a spiritual communion. I love you, O oh my God. I cannot receive you in holy communion. Come, nevertheless, and visit me with your grace. Come spiritually into my heart. Purify it. Sanctify it. Render it like unto your own. Amen. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to your protection, implored your help, or sought your intercession was left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, I fly unto thee. O virgins of virgins, our mother, to you do we come, before you we stand. Sinful and sorrowful, O mother of the word incarnate, despise not our petitions, but in your mercy, hear and answer them. Amen. O Mary, conceive without sin. Pray, Pray for us to have the course today. May the heart of Jesus in the most blessed sacrament be praised, adored, and loved with grateful affection at every moment in all the tabernacles of the world, even to the end of time. Amen. Saint Michael, the archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and the snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the heavenly host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl around the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Let us pray. Keep safe, O Lord, we pray, those whom you have saved by your kindness, that redeemed by the passion of your Son, they may rejoice in his resurrection, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. The Mass is ended now. Stay in peace. Thank you again for listening and watching the Holy Mass today. Later on, we'll have the benediction and the rosary. God bless all of you. Christ is alive. Let Christians sing. The cross stands empty to the sky let streets and homes with praises ring loved drowned in death shall never die
Lord, you are here on the altar. We ask now that you bless each one who would look at you on the TV, on the websites, cell phones. May your love, your grace penetrate their hearts and strengthen them until the day again when they can come to the churches and receive you in the Eucharist. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father, the Almighty, the Creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, his only Son, O Lord, who was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead, and on the third day he arose again, and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again to judge the living and the dead. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. We offer up three Hail Marys for an increase in the virtues of faith, hope, and charity. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sins now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sins now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The five sorrowful mysteries. The first mystery is the agony in the garden. The fruit of the mystery is sorrow for sin. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, woman, women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sins now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sins now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. 
O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us in the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. The second sorrowful mystery is the scourging at the pillar. The fruit of the mystery is purity. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sins, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sins, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. And glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us in the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those of most in need of thy mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The third sorrowful mystery is the crowning with thorns. The fruit of the mystery is courage. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us in the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. The fourth sorrowful mystery is the carrying of the cross. The fruit of the mystery is patience. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. And glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Ave, ave, ave Maria, ave, ave, ave fifth sorrowful mystery is the crucifixion and death of our Lord. The fruit of the mystery is perseverance. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God. For the Pope's intentions and for the indulgence this day. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed art thou, O my women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sins, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was as Most sacred heart of Jesus, O Mary, conceive without sin. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. wonderful sacrament left us a memorial of your passion. Grant, we implore you, to venerate the sacred mysteries of your body and blood, as always to be conscious of the fruit of your redemption, you who live and reign forever and ever.
the divine praises. Blessed be God, blessed be his holy name, blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man, blessed be the name of Jesus, blessed be his most sacred heart, blessed be his most precious blood, blessed be Jesus and the most holy sacrament of the altar, blessed be the Holy Spirit, the paraclete, blessed be the great mother of God, Mary most holy, blessed be our holy and immaculate conception, Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, our most chaste spouse. Blessed be God and his angels and in his saints. May the heart of Jesus in the most blessed sacrament be praised, adored and loved with grateful affection at every moment in all the tabernacles of the world, even to the end of time. Amen. to do the best you can and God willing we'll be here again tomorrow God bless all of you Hark the loud celestial hymn angel choirs above our raising cherubim and set of him in unseen Chorus praising, fill the heavens with sweet.